Hi, I'm Michael Gaffney from the San Diego School of Flower Design. Today we're going to talk about simple designing. I'm the author of Design Star, my new book. Uh, basically the book covers uh, 24 styles of design which will teach you how to do almost everything you'd ever see in a magazine or on a gorgeous website. It's all in my new book called Design Star. Um, we also talk about the economics and marketing and selling of flowers, so there's a lot in the book. It's not just, uh, it is a lot of pretty pictures, but there's also a lot of uh, interesting stuff in here, behind the scenes in a flower shop and uh, event designers, what really happens, how much you should uh, charge for flowers, things like that, markups. Um, but uh, today we're going to give you some quick, easy design tips. Right out of the book, chapter three, hydrangea base bouquet. We're going to start with some gorgeous hydrangeas. These are from New Zealand, and I'm going to make a little triangle. See that? Row one at your concert. Next, I'm going to put a second row underneath. Notice how I'm angling this. That's the secret. You would do this at home. Stack them. You've got to learn how to angle your flowers. See where that one came out? Right there. So I'm going to put another row below that first row. And I've already got a beautiful design. It's pretty already, right? There. Now, all you have to do is take some roses, clean them off, get rid of the leaves and the stems, and use this as a flower holder and just loosen up your grip a little bit and they come out the bottom and there it is, right up there, boom. Right in the center of the bouquet. Uh, this is one of the most requested bridal bouquets in America. I work for a lot of magazines in New York, a lot of runway shows, and this is what a lot of uh, they want. See that? Pull it in right there, holds it perfectly in place. Put a couple in there. Put a few around the edges, like that, and we've got half our bridal bouquet done. Again, I did this, what, bouquet in about two minutes. That's what uh, flower designing is all about. Effortless, easy breezy, enjoying your flowers and making gorgeous designs. So I'm just going to finish this off. Put a few more roses over here, like that, and then maybe I'll take a little filler. This is called Sterling Range, and add a little bit of a uh, kick to the outside of my bouquet by collaring it with a little bit of sterling range. Oops, again, flower designing. I teach my students in class, it's easy, it's effortless. Once you've been shown how, the right way. I think it's different than being an artist, you know. They pour, their, they, uh, uh, pour all their effort and energy into these canvases for hours. When you're a flower designer, it should be fun and, and fast and create gorgeous stuff. Uh, then I'm gonna take a couple of wires and I'm gonna wire my bouquet. And you will have a gorgeous bouquet. I don't have any wires. We'll leave it at that. I'll wire it another day. So here's our end result. We've got this great all mass design, gorgeous uh, peach roses, uh, hydrangeas from New Zealand, a little bit of sterling range. Three flowers, that's it. Then we're going to wire it. See that finger? Wiggle it like that. Wire it nice and high. Put a couple of wires around it. You can also do chenille stem. You're going to give it a little twist upside down like that, just to tighten up, and there you go. Chapter three, right out of the book. Easy breezy summer designing from the San Diego School of Fire Design. Again, design classes held four times a year, eight cities across the country. I'll see you in class, thanks.